Hello everyone, Microsoft Excel lets you set a password to limit opening a file, editing or modifying a file to only authorized users. Choosing file, choosing file menu and click save as and click browse button, click tools and click general option. Here you can apply a password to open the workbook and a password to modify the workbook. If you want to restrict viewing of the workbook, you only authorize user enter a password for our password to open here. You can leave this field blank if you want anyone to be able to open file but to prevent anyone from modifying the workbook, enter a password to modify field here. So let's protect the user to opening a file by the password. So let me type the password. And the second tag box is for the password to protect for the user to modify the workbook. And then click OK. You will be prompted to re-enter the password to opening a file. So make sure you put the same password as the previous one. And click OK and then you will prompt it to re-enter the password to modify the file. And make sure you put the same password as previous one. And click OK. And then select the location of the file where you want to save the workbook. So in this case, I store the workbook on desktop and put whatever. I put the file name uh, restrict workbook. Let's close the workbook and reopen the workbook that we have just protected. So the file name is on desktop and restrict the book. The file name is here and double click to opening. The workbook will prompt you to put the password to open. So put the password and click OK. And another dialog box will prompt you to put the password to modify. So if you don't have password to modify the workbook, you can click read only. The file workbook open in read only. You cannot modify the file. Let's try. You can enter whatever information here on the workbook. When you click the save button, the alert box tells you that we cannot save restrict workbook because the file is read only. When you press OK, so the workbook asks you to save us to another file name because you cannot uh, modify the original file name. So let's close the workbook again and don't save it and reopen. Put the password to open the workbook. At this time, I put the password to modify the workbook and click OK. So I modify the workbook and click save button again. So the workbook allow us to modify and save to the same file name. Thank you so much for your watching. If you want to get more video or training like this, please subscribe.